So hello, my name is Christine Lyons and I've been creating a drawing every day for 2016. And um, I've been learning a lot from it and it's been already proving a really great experience although it's only February. Um, firstly for me personally because it puts something into my day which is I have a seven month old boy and a seven year old daughter. So it puts something into my day which is purely creative, purely for me, that I do and I share with people that isn't just school run, nappies, washing. I love my children, don't get me wrong, but mums can get a little isolated and into that round of routine work. Um, so another thing that has been really nice about it is I've been sharing my drawings on Facebook and Instagram and places and I've had so much feedback and my friends have been enjoying it. And I've noticed a big upsurge in the amount of artwork that my friends have been sharing on social media. Um, perhaps a little inspired by me. Um, I didn't start the project with anything in mind. I just have an artist friend, Dominic Roberts, who was doing it and it sounded like fun. Um, here I'm drawing an otter. And uh, another thing that's been said to me is that what how lovely it must be for me to have such a skill and to be able to create something every day and feel the enjoyment of that. And um, that is lovely and it's also not difficult to acquire. All skill is simply know-how and practice. Um, so I thought maybe I could share some of that know-how with my friends. Um, I have a degree in textile design. I grew up in an arty family. A lot of my skill was from learn watching my parents and watching my big brother draw and paint. Um, so I've included, you can watch me draw, I thought I'd upload a video every week. Um, I think the first thing I've learned about art is don't stop yourself. Think of yourself as a fireman. There's a burning building, you're a professional, get to the, in there and get people. Or in this case, get to the end of the drawing. Don't say, oh well, you know, I didn't spend 20 minutes thinking about it yet, so I'm not really in the mood. Or you know, I did a fire once, didn't go too well. Get to the building, get the people out. Of course you need some self-criticism, but you can save that till the end when it's gone through all its awkward stages. And then, okay, sometimes you do do a real buffer. But if that's the case, make sure you've validated all the good bits and learnt everything you can so that you can do it more right next time, rather than just say, this is bad, I'm cleaning. Um, and that is basically the strongest thing. 